Welcome back. Today, we're gonna show you the comprehensive step-by-step -step Ionic 5 tutorial on creating an offline price checker using SQLite, barcode scanner, and Angular 9. The price checker usually uses by the store or retail business to check the actual price of the item, product, or goods. So inside this app will contain an SQLite database table of products that have fields ID, price lookup or PLRU, product code, barcode, product name, product descriptions, and product sale price. This tutorial divided into several steps. Step number one, create a new Ionic 5 app with Angular type. Step number two, install and configure the required plugin or libraries. Step number three, implementing price checker. Step number four, run and test the Ionic 5 price checker app on device. The table of the SQLite look like this. It has ID, PLU, barcode, prodem, products, and price. The following tools, frameworks, plugins, and libraries are required for this tutorial. Node.js, stable or recommended version. Latest Ionic 5, Angular 9, and Capacitor. Ionic Native SQLite plugin. Ionic Native barcode scanner plugin. Terminal or command line. Text Editor or IDE, Android or iOS devices, Android Studio, and Xcode. Let's get started with the main steps. Step number one, create a new Ionic 5 app with Angular 9 type. We will use Ionic CLI to create a new Ionic 5 app. For that, we need to install or update the Ionic CLI to the latest version. Before that, make sure you have to install Node and NPM. To check the installed Node.js and NPM, tap these commands from the terminal or Node's command line. That's the version that we are currently using right now. To install or update Ionic CLI, tap these commands. Now we have these versions of Ionix CLI 6. Next, create a new Ionix 5 app by type this command. Select Angular as the framework that integrates with Capacitor by using Y because we will use Capacitor to build the price checker app to mobile devices or simulator. Next, go to the newly created Ionic 5 folder, then run this new Ionic 5 app for the first time. If there is a question to install Ionic Lab, just type Y to install it. If your browser opens this Ionic 5 app automatically and solve a blank Ionic app like this, then your Ionic app is ready to develop. Next, we can close this Ionic app lab and stop the running Ionic app. Next, open this Ionic 5 app with your IDE or text editor. We are using Visual Studio Code, so we just type this command. Step number two. Install and configure the required plugin or libraries. As we mentioned in the first paragraph of this tutorial, we will use the Ionic Native Barcode plugins for scanning the product barcodes and Ionic Native SQLite plugin to get products data. To install those plugins, type these commands.
Next, open and edit is RCF app module CS. Then add this imports. Add those modules to ng module providers. Next, open and edit is RC app app component TS. Then inject the SQLite to the constructor. Next, add the functions that create an SQLite table and the dummy data to the SQLite by that contains value, barcode, number, product name, product descriptions, and price. For this example, we are using a real-world product that has barcode on it. As you can see, we just insert data to SQL table only if there's no data in the table. Call that function inside the constructor body. Now the new IONIQ native SQLite and barcode plugin is ready to use. Step number three, implementing price checker. We will use two ways of checking the product price. They are by scanning the barcode, then match the existing products in the SQLite table and by type the product codes in the input text. Open and edit is RC app home homepage TS. Declare the following variables at the top of the class body. Inject imported modules to the constructor. Add the functions to input the product number, value, or barcode text manually. Add the functions to run barcode scanner and send the scanned barcode text to the match product function. Add the functions to match the product number, value, or barcode text with SQLite product table. Add the functions to clear the variables.
Next, open and edit its RC app, home, homepage, HTML, then replace all HTML tags with this. Step number 4. Run and test the IONIQ 5 Price Checker app on device. Now it's the time to run this IONIQ 5 and SQLite offline price checker app to the Android or iOS device. Tap these commands to add the Capacitor Android and iOS platform. Next, build the IONIQ 5 app by type this command. Copy the build IONIQ 5 app to Android and iOS. To run this IONIQ 5 app to the Android device, run the Android Studio by type this command. Then connect your device using the data cable and it will appear in this toolbar of device list. Then run this app from Android Studio Toolbar Play button. To run this app to the iOS using Xcode, type this command. Then connect your iPhones or iPad using a data cable or then run this app from the Xcode. If you are using an iPhone or iPad devices, make sure you have to change the bundle ID to your domain that registered in Apple developer accounts and change the build settings sign in the Flowman team to your personal Apple developer account that is the Ionic 5 tutorial create offline price checker using Angular 9 and SQLite and barcode scanner plugins you can get the article and the full source code link in the descriptions below. If you think you like this tutorial, please click like, share, comment and subscribe to this channel. Thank you.